Hello once again everyone, and welcome to my indie horror game, Home. It's a unique horror adventure. Your game would be saved automatically. It's a bunch of You know what that means? An hour and a half of recording time. These are instructions. Seems simple enough. Turn up the lights. Say what? But I can't turn off the sun. I'm going to be playing this at like seven o'clock at night. But I am wearing headphones, so... Where was I? It was so dark. A flashlight. Gotta have a flashlight. Wow, look at this. Pixel graphics here. Jesus, look at that. There was a body lying on the floor. Who was he? Yeah, I'm really excited about playing this game. It cost me a lot of money. It was like a pound or something. Cat. I limped I moved down the stairs. How did I hurt my leg? I wondered. All I could really recall was coming home, seeing Rachel. I was upset. She looked afraid. I shook my head and tried to clear it. I knew I should head downstairs trying to find a way out. Shop is full of books. Go this way. An old dining table covered in dirty dishes for two people. There was dozens of beer cans and other liquid bo liquor bottles amongst the dishes. The smell was turning my stomach. So Zoom guy ate some stuff. Drink some beer and other liquor. Hoping this hasn't crushed. Wood. Okay, I managed to get it back working. Don't know why. There must have been a just a button, just press button maybe. I've got it. Wine and those. Yes, no. Okay. I've got it. So, yeah. So, basically, I'm going to be recording this all the way through.
wächst gerne auf. I'm doing pretty good. In moment. I just ate my dinner, so I'm ready, ready to record this for you guys. We're downstairs now. So look, the door there. The front door was blocked by a pile of furniture, and you had to find another way out. We get a dog that which we can go through. The man's wife who did the cleaning or him. They could clean that room. Which we can't interact with any. check these things out, don't you? Oh, well, let's go down into the basement. That's not going to be creepy whatsoever. <laughs> I hear the box for it, and you finally gave it. Where can go? There was a lot of going underground where the box was. And then smell rose from the patches. Then we climb down the ladder. My leg was in terrible shape, but I had to get out. The guy upstairs must have done this. What a tower. So I got some advice from one of my friends about how I can improve my um, videos, and she said try to speak more clearly, get a better mic and camera, which obviously. I'm not very happy with the mic I've got, I don't know. If you want me to get a new mic to record these things, I'm quite happy to look into that. A new camera, maybe, is a possibility of me getting one of them. Because my current camera, well, I use my laptop to record my vlogs, which aren't, isn't the best thing to do. She said about speaking clearly and confidently and all that sort of stuff. And I try my best to do that. Let's not take the handle. Although I'll probably regret that later when I come across some creature that will need to be shot. But yeah, so I'm gonna, I don't know, I'll, I'll try and speak more clearly and confidently. It's just difficult, you know, just 
I try and be the best I can be speaking wise. It's just difficult to have the confidence to do this sort of stuff because I'm not like, I don't really speak a lot in, in real life to people. It's just something I struggled with most of my life, being shy and stuff. So, so we got a good thing. I think that it's beginning to be more creepy. And that dripping sounds quite creepy as well. But yeah, so I'm gonna try and speak more confidently through this and through my other let's plays, try and speak more clearly about things. And hopefully I will improve it. And then if you really want me to get a new mic, I can sort that out. Not immediately, but as soon as possible. I, I'm basically because I'm going home the day after tomorrow. There's no point in me ordering the mic or anything or looking into it until I'm home. My mics cost some amount of money as well. So yeah. Hev and Eve. A A A The guy and his wife who live in this place, the guy had a drinking problem clearly and to get out on his wife. By the sounds of it. And did something to her. What talk or something like that. They have glow clothes in them, oh my god! Wait, there are old clothes. This is just getting more creepy. So this couple took our old clothes. Ooh, bats! Batman would have a trouble here, wouldn't he? Well, young Batman. Claim down this pretty heavy. Yes. I just keep on descending in this place. Sounds like a machinery of some sort. What the head? So there's a cave in as well. Burn. But it could have been worse if I just dropped down with my legs all. So oh, I should have probably took that gun because of the sound I'm hearing. I will. 
Oh, are you gonna come across zombies or something stupid like that? Like water. What was that? Kitchen knife covered in drying wood. Thinking right, it made me sick. I didn't want to touch it. Do I take it? I was really new to you. I'm leaving all these weapons. Halo Silentium, which is the third Halo book in the Forerunner saga. Uh, it's basically very interesting to me because I love Halo.
there should be all the water off. And do we have to do anything with this console? Blah, 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 and it doesn't look like it. So we should be able to go down that the ladder now because the water's on. Press enter too quickly. Oh, space such one. It's yeah. Enjoy that broke it brought a lot of revelations to sort of the backstory of the Halo universe for me. To explain some of the stuff okay, that, that led leads into mainly Halo 4 but other games as well. Like I explained some of the backstory to a couple of the characters. And I really enjoyed reading that book. They are good books to read. If you're a Halo fan I would recommend reading the four in the saga, and there's the other one, the Kilo 5 series as well, that's pretty, there's only two books out of that, and I mean, well, that's pretty good, it builds the, the story between Halo 3 and Halo 4, and stuff like that, I found another dead body, a super wake, he was a mess, but he looked like he'd been stabbed. There's key ring. Might be useful. I'm guessing it might open a door that I've come across. Let's go back, see if one of the doors we've come across. Or forehand. It opens now. Session with some sort of killer. 
and you might just shit that just stabbed me a little bit I might have killed some people down here in the sewers Difficult, but I felt de a desperate need to escape the thought of that video saved so they gave me chills. Who was it that didn't want to be seen? Was it the same person that had all those newspaper clippings away in that locked room? As I reached the top of the ladder, part of me hoped I would never know. I pushed aside my thoughts as I struggled with the latch above me and as I swung up the cover to make my escape. The awful smell of that suit gave way to the dank essence of pine trees. If we can go that way, can we go? We can't go that way, so it's this way we have to go. That was. sounded like it needed anything. There's a ladder there. The rusty door was locked tight with an old padlock and the faded sign on the door warned about some kind of train yard it must have referred to the town's only train station. It didn't look like I'd been able to get through it at all. This must have been the entrance to the fire stop. I was mentioned that my parents and three of them was hiking around in those tunnels. I didn't leave that moment. I was trying to scribble notes on this place, but I couldn't make them out. Here, the sign pointed out of various campsites. I'm walking past within the woods. I mentioned a river, maybe a washing room, but the rest was faded. Too faded to see clearly. Take this plank, might be useful at some point.
Okay. We managed to get through the woods. Why would anyone abandon a campsite in the middle of the night in the woods? It doesn't make any sense at all unless some bear came along and raided them and they just climbed to the tree or something like that. Maybe that's the way it went. Kinesis. Machinist. That's it. That's the word machinist. Man, that wind's gonna disturb the leaves. We can go through a hole or through this door. Let's go, Let's go through this door. What is that? What it looks like, the sunk up and its contents were tossed around like someone had been looking for something. There is a large power box with five lights on it and cables burst out of the box, sneaking off the other parts of the The metal was starting to wear and cobwebs had clipped on the corners. The box wasn't receiving power. The door was locked shut and there was a dozen box into the hand. I sat and with face it there I said, danger clothes for repairs. Door was locked. So we got us all that power box. Bulletin board, eh? Yellow clippings of newspapers, cartoons, and notices. There were notices to and from the guys that were here. One of them was to Norman, who was one of the old guys on the line. A roll break table, the layer of dust and grime only means seeing this sting more. Stay on this dope. Mm -hmm. So there's no one guy who was a friend of ours and he took over a journal store. Panel looking like it was shut off. Do I push the switch? Of course, we press the switch. Hmm, another power panel. Forwards. So there's that gap in the fence which I we haven't explored, which I might go back and explore. Who's <coughs> this 
this was normal as fucking the door was standing like someone had punched it. I don't remember him doing that when we was working there. So someone punched. No one's locker. I never pun on that. I hoped I'm not gonna get punched. Why is this right here? It's on. A vanity utility show crammed with mesh my tools and items. There was a climb on the shelf. Do I take the hammer? Yes. It seems to have been recently used. <laughs> Lucky was a complete mess. Heading at the bottom there was a magnetic card. Do I take the card? Yes, you do. Another power panel. Let's try another one as well, shall we? Nope. It's not turned on fully. Took a couple of switches dead. And so on. A couple of them. Now, we should be able to use this hammer to get through that locked door back here. And then the carrot to get through a different door. Just leave that hammer behind. Why don't you? This was my luck at that angle. This thing could There was a picture of which one inside. It looked like it had been torn with the hammer. I had taken that picture of it and the factory closed. So this guy's definitely an alcoholic. And he has some sort of stalkers in sync that. Against us, he seems to kill people. It's something against Norman by the sound of it. I used the card, yes, of course you did. like I've gone like 45 minutes or something like that. I'll stop the recording and then start another recording to split this into two episodes or something. Oh, we don't get didn't get to check that hole in the fence. God damn it. Pickle. I can smash into the guy that almost sits on him. I just see. Mm -hmm. 
That is rug sound gun. Doesn't sound good at all. Scary this pretty. There's a dog in it, right? Yeah. Don't know. I'm gonna scare this way fast. There's no TV. No one might kill her, Cone. The team brings her head in this time. They can't be saying he's on the chair. How did he help? Some shit in front of you can't tell I'm trying to get to both because I don't know why you're shocked. Oh, then you deserve better than this. Can you go in this way? Searching a track, can we find a hairpin? It can help us unlock doors. Let's go through this other door at the top. See, I don't think that's gonna be his bedroom, probably. Despite the shank of a room, I'm not gonna be able to sneak this. Should we just use one of Rachel's old? Oh my god, what was it doing there? Is she okay? Oh no! What? There's one more team gun cabinet here. I didn't know much about guns, but it looked like. Can't tell. Couple hunting rows, maybe even. A few pieces of have one of the guns, one's missing. Someone's took a gun, no more! <laughs> Look, but there's nothing. Usually, things makes me think we can goods. There is room to do what's missing in it. I'm not fast. I could probably make things inside it. My eyes probably seem to be in front. It must have been. Oh, for all, most of his contents were half melted. There were various postcards from the area, especially from the tourist shops. One of the postcards shows an old block and white photo of the water tower that looked to be in much better shape then. <coughs> what else would be before? Before? Didn't seem that we looked there dead. I turned my stomach just to think of it, but I couldn't put it out of my mind. How was he involved in all this? Was this was getting worse and worse. I was starting to feel incredibly vulnerable. As I stepped out into the rain, I realized how close I was to him. Hoped I would soon find my answers. I've been going about 45 minutes. It's 
point. So I'm going to need to stop the recording and then I'll have, like, when I stopped the before to check what was up and figure out what was wrong. That little bit of recording in this one will go into one episode and then the one after this, which I'm going to record like immediately, will be another episode which I'll have stored for later purposes. It's going to be buggy to have so much recorded on my computer, but you know, make rendering times a lot longer. But I feel like because it suggests playing this game in one sitting, you know, it'd be better to do this this way. So yeah. So yeah, I'm going to pause it here, guys. I'll see you guys for the next episode. Bye.